The giant spine lizard was larger than a T-Rex and hunted its prey underwater. Until recently, scientists thought dinosaurs were terrestrial. But in 2014, a terrifying new monster was discovered. It was a Spinosaurus, and its features pointed to an aquatic lifestyle. It had retracted nostrils, short hind legs, a fin-like tail, and paddle-like feet. Of course, the Spinosaurus is most famous for its spine. Its very name means giant spine lizard. Spinosaurids were a family of predatory dinosaurs. Some of them reached 50 feet in length. Larger than a T-Rex, they had very dense bones. This suggests they were adapted to life in the water. Spinosaurus would have been able to swim and hunt while submerged underwater. Another Spinosaurid capable of this was Baryonyx. The ancestors of Spinosaurus and Baryonyx evolved ballast. This provided stability in the form of dense bones. However, Spinosaurus most likely struck at food from above. Perhaps it hunted from shore or while cruising lazily on the water's surface. Its nostrils are placed back on its skull. Animals that spend much of their time submerged have different nostrils. Hippos and crocodiles, for example, have nostrils in front. But Spinosaurus has nostrils like a heron. Herons feed by dipping their snout in the water to feed. Still, it was definitely able to submerge. It couldn't have been a really fast swimmer with that large sail. The exact function of the sail is still a mystery. It wasn't simply a flat, oversized outgrowth of skin. This structure grew on a scaffold of neural spines. These long, thin projections of bone attained lengths of nearly six feet. They were attached to the vertebrae of the dinosaur's backbone. These spines have been preserved in fossil specimens. Spinosaurus inhabited northern Africa in the Cretaceous period. It shared its habitat with Sarcosuchus. Sarcosuchus was a 40-foot-long, 10-ton prehistoric crocodile. Spinosaurus fed mostly on fish. Sarcosuchus spent most of its time half-submerged in water. So these two mega-predators must have occasionally crossed paths. They may even have actively targeted one another. Spinosaurus is the current record holder among carnivores. A full-grown adult Spinosaurus weighed 10 tons. That's about a ton heavier than a Tyrannosaurus rex. It's also half a ton more than a Giganotosaurus. Unfortunately, too few Spinosaurus specimens are extant. It's possible that other individuals were even larger. Spinosaurus had a complicated assortment of teeth. Two giant canines jutted out of its front upper jaw. A few bigger ones were set farther back in the snout. A variety of straight, conical, grinding teeth were in between. Most likely, this was a reflection of Spinosaurus's varied diet. It included not only fish, but birds, mammals, and possibly even other dinosaurs. 